power video series. Today we're going to be looking at the Power R200. It features the inverter welder design in IGBT electronics. It's compact, lightweight, and easy to use. Its industrial features include 60% duty cycle and portability to about anywhere on the job site. Part of the unit's industrial design is that it features 6010 burning capability. Uh, it's uncommon to find small inverter welders that can burn a 6010 very easily, but we have a special 6010 port connector right here for burning a 6010 rod. It'll burn a 5P, 5P plus, or whatever that you have to burn in the 6010 category. It, it'll burn a very stable, very easy arc. Now this is your negative connector for your uh, work clamp. You also just use your regular connector for your positive side on your electrode holder. As you can see, the unit features infinite, easy to use amperage control. You can infinitely adjust the amperage up and down to whatever amperage you desire incrementally. You have an overcurrent light that comes on in case you exceed the duty cycle, which the duty cycle on this unit is 60%. Today we're going to be welding a V-Group open root plate for demonstration. This is a typical test plate. We're not a full 10 inches, but we're sitting at 8 inches, so we're going to have a nice test plate here ready to go pretty soon. But it's open root, V-Group, 60 degree. It's already been prepped front and back. Uh, with a land and uh, we're going to be using this 332nd 6010 to make the root pass following up fill and cap passes with a 7018. Here we've used this step and pause motion to create the root pad. So I'm going to clean it up and we'll show you in just a minute. This is the back side. It's been a while since I've welded an open root plate, but uh, you can see the penetration that you get all the way down. There's a little bit right here where the plate started closing up to on me on the end, but uh, I'll clean it up and you can see the entire plate here. Here you can see the step and pause right here. Um, like I said, it's been a while since I've done an open root plate and used a 6010 in this manner. But uh, this is your standard test plate type weld for your root pass. If you look on the back side, you can see the weld is penetrated all the way through. I've got a little in, uh, complete fusion here. That's why I'm going to restart and I should have ground it back and but being in a hurry to do this demonstration, I did not. But anyway, this is this is the type of penetration you'll get with the 6010. Now we did have an open root, but we had a 3/30 second land as well. So you'll be able to see this uh, as we anytime you make an open root weld, you should see a nice looking weld on the back side too. Okay, this is going to be the next fill pass, the 7018, we set about 120 amps.
get started. As you can see, we've got a nice smooth pass here with the 7018. You're going to find you know, a couple of inconsistencies here and there. But overall, it's a pretty good pass. And I'm going to make one more pass, and I'm going to do your cap pass on this pass. It probably could take two more passes, but I'm going to fill it in one. This is just for demonstration. This is not for test. So this is, uh, this is going to just to show you the ability and the capability of this machine. Here you can see we got it right about the right amps. Flux is peeling up behind the well. We've turned it up to about 100. Well, we've got it right around 123, 125 amps. So, you can see it's laying in nicely on top of the oven. We've got good fill, good tie in on the edges. We're going to finish up this with the next rock. Okay, here you can see the, the nice fine work this unit does. Had a little bobble right there and did a little fill after it, but then when I started, uh, that was on the restart. But as you can see, it does make a nice fine puddle. And the only limitation is the welder doing the work himself. So you can get a good idea how this unit welds. It's a fine welding machine. It's very portable, very compact. And with this 60% industrial duty cycle that it has, you can keep up with the big boys with a small package.